Well, sadly for those who are exposed to the elements, I'm afraid that the clouds have opened up and it is teeming down here. There are some fans who are going to get very, very wet. Having said which, there are almost no empty seats. It is a terrific turnout under the circumstances. There's nowhere else to go, in truth, if you want to see this much-anticipated game. So, come rain or come shine, we are here and really looking forward to it. Blue and burgundy wherever you look, hymns ringing loud and proud. This is what it is to be in the Camp Nou. Who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Gerard Piquet. He's just about the toughest opponent you can imagine when it comes to one-on-one -on -one tussles, Peter. Pretty much unbeatable in the air or on the ground. He's also very comfortable on the ball and quite adept at picking a pass, whether it be long or short. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. the way this is quite a run and he's not done yet and that'll go straight through to the keeper Jordi Alba drives it forward Drives it towards the front. Sticks in a foot to win it back. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. gem of a cross that made the header simple well as contact goes that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net I think when it comes to the aerial department this fella is definitely no slouch Barcelona break the deadlock still a fragile lead though they can't afford to sit on this now it's Messi Messi Good run, where to from here? It's anyone's ball. Messi with a really impressive run, which nearly went the whole way. Yeah, the confidence we can admire, the decision-making we can't. He learned from it. Griezmann gets away from his opponent. Griezmann crossed, up he gets! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. So that's two now without reply. We're looking at a very different game now. The command has been established. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. And here's Griezmann. Griezmann. There are a few waiting. Great leap! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Why the lead can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. <laughs> it's a good foot in there. And the counter is on. Whistle goes for half time. Go back on the first 45 minutes. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position. So why do they from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Barcelona go in at half time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half.
Unal. He's got it and he's got time. Hoists it forward. Foot in. Brings it forward. Now the counter. And he's shown him a Pjanic! Yes! And they are pulling clear here. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Just brushed off the ball there. Well, that's a foul. Three kicks been given. Has a hit! A real chance and a real let off. Oh, that's a waste. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. He's come loose. Messi really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. And he's on a charge. Can't get the better of his opposite number. And it's played forward. Well, he's made sure that that won't get through. Neto. And it's Griezmann. Battles to win it back. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Forward it goes. And now the breakaway. And time is up. Barcelona a class apart, opponents torn apart, they are comprehensive winners. Your final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, and the result that was true to form, a big team beating a, a not-so-big team, and the lesson dealt. Many thanks to Jim.